Hey, I'm Jason from the Cubs Guest. Welcome back to another episode of Free Random Games, a series where I find some of the most random games out there on the internet and I play them for you right here in this video. I can't promise that they're gonna be any good, but I can promise that we're gonna have some fun. So if you guys cool that you down with that, everybody get ready and buckle up, cause here we go! First game in today's episode is called Her Apartment. We are going to her apartment, and I'm pretty sure it's gonna be our first date. You know what I mean? We gotta play it cool. I gotta be like, hey, my name is Jay. Are you ready for the best doing? prices? I'm doing Let's great. Go. When you order anyway. this more within one minute, you will get two more for absolutely free. Nice. This offer is only for a limited time. Don't hesitate to call now. I promise you I won't. Oh, somebody's calling me. See, I don't call anybody. People hit my line. People ask me what's up. Interact, shift, sprint, R&B, zoom, okay, whatever. Hello? Hello? Jay speaking. Oh, shit. Okay, I didn't know we had voice acting. Hey, Ray. It's Margaret. Sorry for calling so late, but I'm going out of state for a week. Could you please take care of my cat, water the flowers, and occasionally pick up my mail? I would really appreciate it. I'll take care of that cat, all right. Hello, Mrs. Olson. Of course, I'd be happy to help. When I get home from work in the evenings, I can take care of everything you need. Bro, I could have done a better voice than this AI stuff. Great. I want to be Mrs. Olson. I'm leaving tomorrow morning. Won't you come over to my apartment now so I can show you what you'll need to do? Sure. I'll be there in a minute. Mrs. Olson lives in apartment number two. She is the best neighbor a person could ask for. I'm glad she trusts me with her apartment. Okay, so I'm on number four. So a couple more and whoops. Okay, so I guess it skips three. Oh no, that's three. Wee wee cc. -si. Ma'am, where are you? Oh, there you are. Oh, looking good, Ray. You're a charming man. Thank you, Mrs. Olson. What should I do first? At the end of the hall is a door to my junk room. In that room, there's a watering can. Please bring it here. Junk room is crazy. I got junk room and I'm not talking. Never mind. Let's just go. All right. Watering can. Plants watered for. Hey. Yeah, in the living sit your old room. Ass back down. Are the first two plants. Sure. There's one. Got it. Lazy ass couldn't water them yourselves. The last two plants are in the bedroom. I'll wait for you here. Hold on, Mrs. Olsen. <laughs> Hold on, Miss Olsen. Relax. Why are you waiting for me inside of the bedroom? Act like I never watered plants before. But there you go. All right, I think we're going to feed the cat now. I usually feed Kitty half a can in the morning and evening. Does Since Kitty have you're coming only in the evening, just give her a whole can then. The cans are in the kitchen. Does Kitty have a nombre? Como te amas? What's up, Kitty? How you doing? Yeah, eat that. Eat that nasty shit. No need to get the mail today. I already did it. Here are my apartment and mailbox keys, plus $50. $50. Appreciate your help. I'm glad I didn't have to rob you. Thanks a lot. I'll make sure everything's taken care of. Just in case. I'll write all the tasks down and leave the note here somewhere if you need anything. Feel free to call me anytime. See you next week. Take care and good night. Let's go back to my apartment and go to sleep. How come we sound like we have an AI voice and she actually sounds like she has a red... I think I forgot to turn off the lights. Wait, you want me to turn off your own lights? Let's go back to my apartment and sleep. You want me to close your door, right? Okay. Bro, that is so weird. Okay. Let's go to sleep. What the heck? Where's my bed? Oh, I only have a twin size, bro? I'm a grown-ass man with a twin-size bed. I had that shit when I was a young whippersnapper. Come on, stop playing with me. I'm finally home from work. First, I'll pick up the mail for Miss Olsen and me. You hungry? Always. Best pizza in Jewelies. No idea where that is. Oh, here it is. Okay, apartment number two. There we go. Golden Years Travel Agency. Some letter. I'll leave it in her apartment. What about me? Fear in town. Authorities search for escaped psychiatric patient. The escaped. In a chilling turn of events. Oh, I guess I'll be seeing this guy soon. Fine, let's water her plants and feed the cat. Okay. Kitty? Where are you, kitty? I guess I have to water the plants first? Why am I kind of nervous? It's kind of quiet. Yeah, I'm definitely going to see that guy soon. The escaped patient? He's going to escape into my thoughts. Into my mind. Oh my god. God, you are freaking scary, man. See, this is why I love dogs more. I'm just kidding. Who's a good cat? All right. Get 
Oh, what? Oh, whoops. Okay. Water this. And one more time. Do I have to do this in the dark? Like, is that what we're doing? Time to feed kitty. Yes, it is. It is definitely time to feed kitty. Does kitty have a name? Or is your name just kitty? Done for the day. Now I can go to my apartment and get some sleep. Of course. Why am I nervous? I have sweat on my underboot. I don't like it. Nothing scary happening so far. Even though I am a chicken shit, for some reason the hairs on my legs are standing to full attention. Like they are fully erect right now. And I need them to calm down. Another day, another mail collection. Calm down, bro. Nothing like this is like heavy labor or something. This is Everblau Insurance Co. Seriously, do not bend and it's bent. I'll leave the letter at our apartment. Wait, do not bend? Okay, let's go to her apartment and take care of her stuff. Sure. Why not? Where's the cat? Hold on, where's the plant? Is this somewhere else? Oh shit, that is true. Where's the plant? Plant? Where'd it go? Bro, ain't no way the plant just got up and walked off. This is starting to freak me out. I'm gonna call Mrs. Olsen. Pussy. Yeah, she'll know what to do. She'll know what to say. Your old ass better pick up. Hello? Hello, Mrs. Olsen? I've got a problem. A plant is missing. The one in the living room. Hey, Ray. Really? Everything else is fine. Just one plant disappeared. Just one? Yes, Acting like this well, happens all the time. It's here. It literally wasn't here a few seconds ago. I'm not crazy, am I? <laughs> Maybe you're tired. Sorry if I'm bothering you that much with my work. No, no. That's definitely from my work. I hate it there. Sorry to interrupt. I'm gonna go water them. Bye. Wait a minute. That plant was definitely not there. Okay, now you're gonna tell me the kitty is a tiger. Are you who you say you are? You better be who you say you are. I'll slap the dog shit out of you. Anyway, let's get these bad boys watered. Time to feed kitty. Very cute cat. It's all right. I've seen cuter cats. I'm not gonna lie to you. Let me see if that thing turned into a lion. Okay, done. I'm excited to go to my bed. What? I forgot. I think I forgot. What the heck? I think I can, I think I can type shit. Okay, let's go to bed. We are not freaking out, everybody. Let's just sleep in our 20 and wake up and do the same thing. It's like Groundhog's Day. Watch, pick up the mail, feed the cat, feed the plants. I'm wondering what's waiting in the mailbox today. Nothing. Amazing interest up to 0 0.03 per annum for your deposits. Great, love that. Fine, let's go to her apartment. <laughs> she didn't get shit today. Okay, let's water these plants. Wait, everything good? Cat's good, all right. Cat's still chilling. That's what I like to see. Something scary is gonna happen, isn't it? Yeah? All right, fine. Let's go then. Let's do this. I'm ready! The butthole is clinched! Like a shotgun, I'm like, Ch -ch Kitty is sure hungry. How do you know, you asked him? Let's see, let's see how hungry you are. Kitty, you must have lost your bowl somewhere. Yeah, kitty, where you put that bowl at, huh? Where you put the bowlie? Hold on, kitty, you smoking bowls now? Where's the bowl at? It better be here or else! This is the last time your ass is getting fed! Whatever. I hope Mrs. Olsen wouldn't be angry if I left the food on the floor. Let's see. She, there's probably gonna be some ants, right? I'm tired. Finally, I can go to sleep. I kind of feel bad for this cat. Honestly, no lie, if I was house-sitting a cat and some plants, I would just take out a little plate from where Mrs. Olsen eats her food, and I would just let the cat eat from there. Come on, cat's family. They're family, they're pe- Oh, whoops. Okay, I'm tired, I can finally go to bed. Wait, why is my door open? Why is my door open, everybody? Why was my door wide open like some legs? My debit card from Square 8 Bank arrived today. I'm very excited. Oh, look, wanted, Harold Whitmore. 65 years old, slender build, gray hair, 5'10". The person who finds him will be rewarded accordingly. Approach with extreme caution. This old ass dude, all I gotta do is give him one good kick to this old ass wrinkly balls. Just, ha -ha! you know what I mean? Like, ba -ba -ba! Send that dude to an early elderly home. You feel me? Wait, why is the bull there? What the heck, kitty? How'd this bull end up here? Square A bank. Yeah, Raymond Benton. That's what I'm talking about. Oh my god! What the f was that disgustingly loud sound? Jerry, man. Making me hit high notes like Tom and Jerry. Fuck. Screw it. I'm drunk as a skunk anyway. 
You're the one who's taking care of Margaret's apartment now, aren't you? Yeah, I am. And you're the dude who's on the first floor that's being a little bitch again, aren't you? Yes, that's me. Sorry if I disturbed you. What were you doing there so late yesterday? It was three o'clock in the morning. I was banging your wife. What? By that time, I was sleeping in my bed. I wasn't in her apartment. I saw you. I was coming back from the pub. You were waving at me from the window. Ah, uh, you were just seeing things. I was really sleeping. Drunk loser making stuff up again? <laughs> Damn! Bro got so much attitude. All right, somebody's here. Kitty, your bowl has been activated back where it belongs. Let me water the plants. Let me do my thing. But for some reason, I'm feeling very uncomfortable, Kitty. You gonna claw their eyes out if somebody's here? Please do. Come on, somebody was waving at the door. Imagine it was me and I was wearing a dress. I don't know why I'd be wearing a dress. Seeing Kitty eating is the cutest part of the day. I can't wait. Okay, go eat. Come on, Kitty. Let's get some sleep. Yeah, there you go. I thought I wanted to watch Kitty eat because it's the best part of the day. Fuck you mean. Okay, let's close that. And no more jump scares. All right, no more jump scares. No more jump scares. <laughs> Today's my last day taking care of Mrs. Olsen's apartment. This guy's still wanted. Don't say I'm hungry. Say, I'm experiencing an acute and imminent need for nutritional intervention. This condition is characterized by a rapidly diminishing energy reserve accompanied by a persistent rumbling sound emanating from my abdomen. The current lack of sustenance is leading to a noticeable decline in cognitive function and overall mood stability. My stomach is effectively staging a protest against the absence of food. With increasing urgency, immediate action is required to restore equilibrium and prevent further deterioration. A careful selected meal or snack would be highly beneficial in addressing this critical state. I eagerly anticipate the prompt delivery of a suitable nutritional solution to ameliorate this pressing situation. I've never said so many big words in my damn life. That is a first for me. Happy Paws Pet Club. Some letter. I'll leave it in her apartment. Sudden collapse. Square 38 bank shuts down just two days after opening. Uh-oh. Let's go to her apartment. Who's in here? Huh? I know somebody's in here. Stop playing with me. Anybody playing with me? Because if you're playing with me, you're gonna be playing with your life in a second. Promise you. You're gonna be playing with, with gunshots in your chest. That's a lie. That's a lie. All right, let's go. Come on. Let's go feed Kitty for the last time. Sad face. Oh, don't be sad. Don't be sad it happened. Be, be glad it's, it's done. Be glad I don't have to feed this bitch no more. All right, good night, Kitty. I love you. My door's still open. Oh boy. Go to sleep. Why is my door always open? It's not like I have any control over it day to day. Like it should be closed automatically, no? But Mrs. Olsen should be back. Mrs. Olsen should be home by now. I'm going to return her the keys. Mrs. Olsen, where are you? Okay. Hopefully you're here. Mrs. Hi, Mrs. Olsen. Olsen. It's good. Oh, shit! It was the loud noise. 911, what's your emergency? It was a loud noise that got me. I'm not going to lie. I mean, maybe it was seeing his old ass face. I don't know. I don't like seeing wrinkly old people, but it was the sounds. There's a foreign man in my apartment. He attacked my neighbor and now they're fighting. It's my apartment. Mine. Get out. Everybody out. Huh. Don't tell me it ends just like that. After the incident, police found two lifeless bodies. Yeah, Mrs. Olsen and the old guy. Because you know I went ba ba ba! One was of a 24-year-old man and the other of a 68-year-old woman. Oh, so the old man, he definitely killed uh, both of us with ease. With ease, everybody. Emphasis on ease. The previous owner of apartment number two, Harold Whitmore, escaped from the scene. Oh, okay. So he still thought it was his apartment. Police never found him. I thought the twist was going to be that we were Harold Whitmore. I was thinking about that in the back of my mind. But I guess my brain isn't as good as I thought it was. Next game of today's episode is called Inward Eye. What do you mean, Inward Eye? Like, what does that even mean? What does that mean in the grand scheme of things? Holy crap, this sensitivity. Dinner for one again. It's been so quiet since they left. I guess I can't blame them after how I behave. Cooking a good meal at least keeps my mind busy. Cut the meat. You mean this human flesh right here? That looked like human meat. Not gonna lie. Oh, 
Okay. What? 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 A, A. Good job. Move the knife with A and D keys. Oh, I didn't even do that, but I still chopped it to perfection. Mwah. So good. It is fabulous. Mmm. It smells amazing in here. What you making? Thought I'd make your favorite. Oh, honey, thank you. The shop was so busy today, I barely had time to eat lunch. I definitely need some real food. You just lay down and relax for a bit. I'll let you know when dinner's ready. I love you. I love you too. I don't know why I said it like that. Oh. Okay. Simpler days. Missed those times. Living in such a peaceful neighborhood almost gets too quiet sometimes. Let's stir that up. That's curry, right? Because ain't no way we're making spaghetti. All right, watch me chop this up, everybody. Gordon Ramsay just shed a tear because that shit is beautiful. That's definitely curry. Smells good, too. I can smell it. Or maybe it's me. I smell good. Need any help cleaning up? No, I'm all good. I'm just enjoying the view. All right, all right. That's enough. I can't believe the food at the fair today was so interesting tasting. Well, I'm kind of weirded out by these breathing noises. We are lucky to have such a master chef at home to make sure we don't starve. Well, anything would be better than whatever that crap was. Language. I said crap. Acting like I said shitty titty fuckballs, dude. She always enjoyed my cooking. It doesn't quite taste the same as dining solo. Nah, it tastes great. Okay, stir that up. There we go. As you all can tell, I don't really cook like that. Imagine a hand pops out. If a hand pops out, I'm done. Let me do the cooking tonight. I'm sorry. It's okay. We all have those days. Maybe you've just been a little overwhelmed lately. Yeah, I'm sorry I took it out on you. That's not fair. I don't know what came over me. I'm I'm so hungry. Sounds like a serious case of hangry. <laughs> I know how to fix that. It's not DiGiorno, it's Papa John's. Okay. I've previously always been a common collected type of person. It was weird. Is somebody looking at me? I thought somebody... Uh-oh. Coming! Where have you been? Who's that? Oh! I just needed to get away for a little while. I haven't been able to reach you all day. Like I said, I needed to just get away. Get away from what? Your loving wife and daughter? Yeah, that. No, it's not like that. Then what is it? I haven't been feeling like myself lately. I'm scaring myself. Then maybe you should go and get some professional help instead of leaving us all alone without a word. Yeah, maybe I should. Where's this going, everybody? I'm calling it right now. He ate his family. In the end, I see how it all fell apart and why they had to go. I wasn't going to seek any help. I was too selfish and scared. I don't need the bathroom right now. Okay, well, I'm about to shit my pants if a jump scare happens. Let's keep stirring this pot up. Oh, yeah, there we go. A nice bowl of red paste curry, I think. I don't know what that is, but it looks delicious. All right, let's get this. Ooh, that was creepy. Oh, okay. Don't you see I'm trying to help? I don't even recognize you anymore. Whatever has gotten you this way, it's ruining our lives. He definitely ate them. I... I can't... I, I don't know what is happening to me anymore. No matter what I do, I can't stop it. We've been over this so many times. If you won't try to get help, that's it. You are scaring me and you are scaring her. And I won't let you do that. We can't live like this. Oh, please, just... Just... Enough! What? What are you doing? Please! Stop! Please! He ate them. He devoured them, no crumbs. Right? <gasps> Caught it! I told you! Come on now! This dude eats people! Last game today's episode is called The Straw Man. You are on the side of the road. I think your car broke down and you stumble upon like a random farm in the middle of buttfuck nowhere and you have to handle business, okay? You have to handle that because some spooky things are gonna happen, but not on my watch. We're taking care of things today. I think I would go crazy if I was driving on a road and I saw like a cornfield like this and it just looked endless. Like there was no civilization in sight. A little fun fact about me, everybody. If I go, oh, okay. All right, a little fun fact about me too. If you 
around with those nails on the road like that, you will find out about these things right here, okay? No lefty and righty, I promise you. Now, but a little fun fact is I like modern technology. I don't like going back to the past. Like if somebody's like, oh, we should visit this old Western town. That's not fun to me. Damn, what's the chance? I need help. There's no signal here. Wait a second. I need the sensitivity to go up a little bit more. Because this is not it, everybody. Look at this. Endless cornfield, bro. This is so corny. I'm not a fan of this. Is this scarecrow going to do anything? Better not. Better not do anything. Or else. Oh, wow. Wait, he just closed on me? Bro, just zipped up on me like a zipper. Now there's another scarecrow. All right. You're going to find out soon. I know it was you that put the nails on the ground. What was that noise? Honestly, I thought it was you. Damn it, someone locked me out. What is this, a prank? Better not be. Or else. Uh, random note, okay. Why is he being different with you? I suffered, I screamed, and it all ended quickly on that road. But you? Why? Because I'm cute? I don't know. Because I'm special? Give me this. Um, how are we getting out of here? How are we doing this, everybody? Come on. Oh, there we go. Okay, automatic. All right, another random note. Bodies found on highway baffle local authorities. Investigations continue after the recent increase in bodies discovered along a rural highway. In the past few months, several drivers have been found dead under mysterious circumstances after stopping on the road due to vehicle issues. The victims, all found near the abandoned cars, showed signs of immense suffering before their deaths, though the exact cause remains unknown. There's no explanation for what we're seeing said a local officer. The vehicles have minor damage, like flat tires, but the brutality in which the bodies are found leaves us baffled. While authorities have released a few details, rumors of supernatural forces have begun circulating among locals. Investigations remain without solid leads, and drivers are advised to avoid traveling alone along the highway, especially at midnight. Interesting. Okay. Well... Oh! Barnkey, thanks. So now we can just go down. Great. Random barn key. How do I get out? There we go. Wait, what? It wasn't like this before. Oh, no. Okay. Well, that's not good. Am I getting close, Lear? Hold on. How did this scarecrow get here? I don't know, but... Relax. Oh. What the hell was that? I must be going mad. Is this real? Am I dead? I think you might be dead. I think you might be clapped. I'm not! Who's that? Like, who, who in the who in the holy fuck was that? <laughs> what happened? Where am I? Bro, some dude just tackled the shit out of you. He looked like he was wearing a tuxedo. That man, he didn't look human. How would you know? You barely saw him. I must be having hallucinations. Yeah, but how do we end up here, though? I better get out of here as soon as possible. Let's go, then. Stop yapping and start running. Can we go in here? Nope. Okay, can't go in there. Uh, I need to find something on the ground. Because I can't open this. Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Let's see. Hold on. There's got to be something on the ground. Oh. Oh. Oh, this is creepy. Oh, I don't like this. Oh, God. Who are you? What in the gobble ghoul are you? Oh, the scarecrow? Come on, bro. This dude could blow away in like a harsh wind. I'm not scared of this guy. Okay, and then we got to flip that generator. Yeah. All right, we got to make that thing go green again. Oh, God. Oh, flip it! What the heck? Bro, I'm not scared of this guy. I'm not scared of this guy. For some reason, it's funny. It's 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 clown show material. Come on. Oh! Okay. Go, go, go. What am I doing? What am I doing? Who am I doing? Where am I doing? Come on, come on, come on. Oh, shit. What the heck? Yeah. I don't know why I said it like that. Go back. Go back, go back, go back, go back. Hurry. Got it. Now what? Can we do this again? Uh, 
We can't do that again. Oh, crap. Please don't. Please don't. Turn me up! <laughs> go, 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 go. Wait, what? Another one? Alright, cool. I didn't even know they were tucked in like that. Alright. So we have to find, what, like a third and fourth one? Alright, I can do that. Can we, can we access? No, no access. No bueno. Okay, I think I saw him. He's right behind me. How many more? How many more? How many times must I suffer? Any more? Yep. Okay. We good? Nope, we're not good. Not good. So not good. We're so not good that we're bad. There you go. How many generators? How many generators are there? What is this? Is that another one? Nope. Wait, what is that? Oh, it's a lever. It's a lever. Oh my fuck! Wow! Oh, oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Oh dear. Oh dear. Psych. Ain't nobody saying oh dear. There you go. The generators have been turned on. Oh no, okay. Okay, okay. Where's the lever? Where's the lever? I love it, but I swear to God, I'll leave her. There it is. Leave her. Okay. Throw it on. Where's that? Where's that door? Where's that door? Don't they stop door? Don't they stop the the big door? Don't they stop big dog? It's right here. Got it. Come on. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Come on. Hurry up, bro. I can't walk under that. Yeah, we got a key. Basement door key. All right. Hurry up. Whoa! Oh shit! Bro, I'm drooling! Why am I drooling over a scarecrow, bro? That is weird! Come on, 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 come on. Uh this way. Yes. Alright. Perfect! Come on. Put that thing in there. Let's go. Alright, Resident Evil style doors. I always thought with these type of doors, like, you know how they're like basically a loading screen? I always felt like some developer was just gonna add like a jump scare for no reason. Should I go up here? Wait, I don't go up there. Where do I go? I'm not going in this house. Yeah, definitely not. Uh, wait. What's going on? Do I just run anywhere? No. Okay, I have to find like an open slot. Let's see. Uh, uh, oh, here we go. All right. That scarecrow better not be scarecrowing or else. Come on, what? Okay, 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 okay. Oh, this is making me disoriented. I am not liking this one bit. Oh shoot, I'm dead. Great. All that for nothing, man. You go through all that just to die, imagine? Bro turning up his head slow like he a main character. You know, ain't John Wick? Just freaking kill me already. That's it. So once you see the nails on the road, the cheeks have already been clapped. And that's how it's done. The straw man. Let's see what happened to us though. We're just blood. Okay, so whatever happened to us remains a mystery. It all just happens here. All right, everybody, but that's gonna do it for this episode of Free Random Games. Hopefully you all enjoyed this episode. If you did, make sure you give this video one big fat like and tell a friend today that Jay from the Cub Scouts is that dude.